take a nice, deep, letting go breath. <sighs> All right, guys, a few days ago, I posted in our private Facebook group a question for you. I wanted to know when you share the fact that you love hypnosis with your friends and family, what kind of questions they ask you. Debbie said these are the questions she receives. What does hypnosis do for me? Hypnosis helps you to reprogram your subconscious mind. How is this different than affirmations? Affirmations happen on the level of the conscious mind, the speaking mind, the thinking mind. The subconscious is where your emotions are stored, where your beliefs about yourself are stored, and where your habits are stored. So affirmations are a really nice thing to do. It can put us in a nice positive frame of mind for a while, but it's not necessarily going to change the programming that makes you who you are. It makes you behave the way you behave. So if you really want affirmations to be extremely powerful, put yourself into a light state of hypnosis before you do them. Do I need to do it forever to get results? This is a great question. So on average, I've said this many times before, you need about six sessions to see 93% improvement. And that was just the number found in a study done by Alfred Barrios, who was a psychoanalyst, and then that was reprinted in American Health Magazine. However, some people can literally have one session, their issue goes away forever. Some people can have 12 sessions, and they find that they need to upkeep their sessions over time, maybe one every three months, one every six months, one every 12 months. It really comes down to the person. The fact of the matter is, hypnosis is not magic. We're not promising some magic pill that you're going to take and it's going to solve your problem forever. But if you want to improve your life, this is one of the most powerful ways to do it. But you have to actually work at it. You have to actually commit to it and you actually have to continue the hypnosis to the level that you need it. The success of hypnosis is predicated upon how badly you want to experience the results after the session. So if you really, really want to quit smoking, you are so done you're gonna quit smoking because of the session. If you really wanna lose weight, if you really wanna heal your relationships, if you really wanna stop having angry outbursts, if you really wanna stop biting your nails, that's what you're going to get out of it. Just make sure you have enough sessions to actually solve the issue. Not all issues can be solved in one session. In fact, that is an exception, not the rule. Most people need an average of six sessions in order to heal their various issues. Why not just take a nap or get more rest to calm down? That's a good question too. It's not just about stress relief. I mean, we are relaxed and we feel safe when we're in hypnosis and that's one of the reasons why we become open to suggestion. But there's a lot of people I know who nap a lot and rest a lot and sleep a lot because they're depressed. It doesn't necessarily mean that just because you get a good night's sleep that all of your inner workings are going to transform. You have to actually meet the programming where it lives and that's at the level of the subconscious mind. Okay, I have a bunch more here that are really, really great. I will respond to them in future Q and A's. I really appreciate you taking the time to share with me what your friends are asking you. The best thing that you can do is be the clean glass of water. Think of it this way. If someone sees a dirty glass of water, right? It's yucky, it's mucky, it's gross. They're not gonna wanna drink from it. They're not going to want to put that into their body or their mind. They're not gonna wanna be a part of that. But if they see a clean glass of water, everybody's going to want to drink that down. So even if your friends and family are not currently interested in hypnosis, that is okay. You do you. Take responsibility for your own life. Take responsibility for your own emotions. Take responsibility for your own actions. And as you clean up your life and as you start living the life of your dreams, you become the clean glass of water. And then everyone around you will start to say, what are you doing? what is it that you're using or what are you on? And you'll be able to say, hypnotherapy has changed my life and here's how, and that's when they'll be ready to listen. So by no means am I suggesting that you push this on anybody, they'll come to it in their own time. So thanks so much for these great questions. Let's go ahead and do close your eyes, get free. Close your eyes, take a nice deep letting go breath 
and repeat in your mind after me. Every day, in every way, I'm feeling better and better. Every day, in every way, I'm doing better and better. Every day, in every way, I'm being more and more kind to myself. Then with a smile on your lips, go ahead and open your eyes. And if you're feeling better now than you were when we started, you're going to absolutely love my grace notes. They're these tiny little daily notes that I send out and over time they reprogram your subconscious mind to be more positive, to be more calm, and to give you more mental freedom. So if you click here right now, be sure to put in your best email address so that they'll reach you. You can start to receive these grace notes right away. Thank you so much for tuning in. Go ahead and give a thumbs up to this video if you liked it and please share this video with those friends of yours who had questions and this can answer them for them. I'll see you next time. Ciao, ciao. Beijos. And so we started to do these principles and it was literally in less than 90 days that we paid off our $18,000. And it still blows my mind because we were doing such little things that didn't seem to even make much progress in the first month and a half. And then it just started to snowball.